we've got the net decrease between the two of them. We then get our net operating income minus that other item takes us to the 1324, which I could double check here by just selecting all of the income accounts. 1324, which we did down here with our check figure down here, and it looks good. Then we can go to our equity account. So the equity account is going to start off with the beginning equity, which is going to be this this 77895 remembering that that is kind of the most confusing number on the on the trial balance because the trial balance is as of the end of the period but that equity number is really the beginning equity because because everything else is going to roll into equity and that beginning equity doesn't have you shouldn't have any activity in the equity account or normally you would not unless say investments for example or draws were posted to the equity account which we did not we posted those here now note also the equity account should tie out to the prior periods you know ending equity account if it does not then that would be an indication that draws or investments have been posted into it you'd look into the gl to see if that is the case or it's an indication that someone did something to the prior period they they deleted a check or voided something or something like that and then you got to deal with that beginning balance problem so we're going to say that's that's the beginning number and then we got these two things that happened draws were taken out and the owner put in